Okay, so we got all our ingredients. We've taken the celery out of the package. We've cut off the ends. We've rinsed it off. We've got one of the onions. We're going to just, again, peel it off. So we have the main part of the onion here. And really, the celery and the onion is, is a pretty critical part of making sure that this stuffing turns out well. Having moist stuffing, I think, is really important. You ever had really dry stuffing? I mean, natural tendency, the typical stuffing is dry. Well, I'm going to show you how not to have dry stuffing. And it starts with things that are water soluble, have a high water content. So onion, besides giving it flavor, has a high water content to it. So this will help keep that stuffing very moist. So we're going to just kind of shred that all up into the mixing bowl. And I'll try not to start crying. I can already start feeling this is a good onion. I can tell. And then you're going to do the same thing with the celery. Simple grater, hand action here. Don't need anything fancy. And we're going to grate this up. Now at the same time, over on the stove there, we've got some of our chicken broth heating up and you can do uh, all chicken broth or you can mix chicken broth with water is fine and then we're going to add some butter we're going to melt the butter in with the chicken broth and the water and we're going to mix it in with the stuffing mix and we're going to put it all into our simple little good sized bowl here so I'm going to go ahead and grind up the rest of these celery stalks and one more onion. So we're going to take two small to medium sized onions and one pack of celery and then I'll see you back in just a minute or two and we'll go to the next step. 